the Cincinnati Reds. Baseball's first professional team know how to throw an opening day. It's so grand, fans from all over the Miami Valley paraded down there today. Christian Hauser takes us to play ball. Tens of thousands of people have jammed themselves into Great American Ballpark, and thousands more are still out here just to be a part of opening day. You can feel the energy and the excitement in the air. For many I talk with, this is actually their first opening day. It's fantastic. The rain held off. Get to take my daughter to her first opening day here. We're going to beat the Pirates. It's a great day. <laughs> thousands line the streets along the parade route to cheer and continue a family tradition. Many of the kids we talked with were taking the day off school. It's really exciting because, like, we go here here every year and it's we usually go with our friends and stuff and it's like it's to be like a national holiday every kid should get off of school people came from all over to check out the parade and the festivities and Wendy says she loves spending time with her two boys checking out the floats what other city hosts this big of a party closes everything down and you know for a single sporting event it's pretty it's pretty amazing and we love the fact that we can be here AJ and Adam say they'll bring their kids to opening day when they're old enough and the fun and festivities aren't just for the young folks this is Carolyn's second opening day. Well, I think it's just the excitement of, you know, baseball season coming around. You know, you got better weather coming, you know, tired of all the winter, and, you know, it just makes you feel better. Back to Leah and her dad. They know today will be something special they can always share. We'll never forget this. We expect the Reds win, and it's, it's really special to do this with my daughter. Reporting in Cincinnati, Christian Hauser, ABC 22 News. Now just this once, we'll forgive you for leaving if you want to watch the 2015 opening game against Pittsburgh. The rain did not hold off, as Tim well knows, so you really didn't miss that much. You can go back and see it on our sister station, Fox 45.